Key Questions in Marine Megafauna Movement Ecology In the introduction, this review notes that we are in a new period of technolo technological advances in animal movement studies. Using data loggers and transmitters, records were created including horizontal and vertical movements, physiology, and reproduction. These types of studies hold the goal to investigate and understand how different species utilize and optimize their movements, how search patterns for prey trend, what factors constrain migration distances, dive performance, and swimming speed. Pictured is figure one included in the paper to express that different species have certain commonalities. Marine megafauna travel through their environments to find resources, food, shelter, a mate, and or a place to reproduce. These movement patterns affect fitness. From these factors and possible similarities between species, questions concerning roles of learning, predator-prey relationships, and energy constraints arise. Figure 2 shows the value of comparisons across a few taxa. In these graphs, the comparisons between different swimmers portrays the data recorded considering body size and endothermy versus ectothermy for swim speed. In this study, experts across many adjacent fields were assembled and asked to produce a list of 10 questions regarding movement ecology of marine megafauna. After all questions were grouped and reworked, the experts voted on the full list. The outcome is shown a bit later in this presentation. The results section of this paper details all compiled questions with the agreed upon answers. The questions review the pros and cons of different movement patterns, the common trends seen of search behavior by marine predators, how environmental factors, learning, memory, and social interactions affect movements, how marine megafauna use their senses to orient themselves while finding prey and mates, how movement data may provide info on the role of megafauna in marine ecosystems, what the driving forces for movement are, and how human activity, such as shipping and fishing, affects marine life movement. Figure 3 shows that predators shape movements across habitats. According to this paper, the risk of predations can have consequences regarding animal movements. Individuals have to balance success with finding food to migrating ratio. How they solve this varies by species. As mentioned previously, the questions detailed in this paper can be applied from marine me megafauna to other taxa, terrestrial or otherwise. Examination of all factors regarding patterns of movement can lead to answers and even more questions in the field of animal biotelemetry. Animal tracking may have its limits, such as tracking one individual might not be beneficial to the animal. So, the continuation of technological advances will be an integral part of more in-depth research possibilities and analyses. While this paper gives a comprehensive list of the general key questions on movement ecology focused on marine megafauna, there are definitely some outstanding questions. We still do not understand the so-called rules of these complex movements along with orientation and navigation. Also, increased technological advances such as smaller and smaller precise and accurate tags will allow data to be taken on early life stages and perhaps throughout an individual's entire life. 